are the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world, so if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Fingers crossed. I see some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. <laughs> oh, Victor. You still do a lot of traveling these days. I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nate that it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot cars now. Yeah, sure. I prefer talking to people face to face. Get a good read on it. Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy named Antiquity Master 37. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Hmm. Not much to see here. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest format. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. Bridge there is what you would call rickety. Ah, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just keep, keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. Getting nowhere fast. You need traction here, okay? I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 four four with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. I'll bet we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch. All right, hang on tight. Oh, shit. You take this slow, kid. Yeah. 
So Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. <laughs> Go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. <clears throat> Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. <clears throat> huh. Bark stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. Hey, did you know our car came with a winch? Oh, really? I didn't know. What you gonna do with it? Not sure yet. There. I know how to do it. like fun. Steeper than it looks. <clears throat> All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> oh, poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. It's taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Damn. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a form of squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Well, still taking a long time. How oh, would you look at that? Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! Sam. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. That's the wrong one, right? That's the good news. And that means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. We do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Hey! 
I think that's it. Damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. They, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure. Oh, 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 oh. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Nadine. Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Ray? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of... Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Singing the same damn thing. If they found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, 
Yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam. You don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But, you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. Pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Check it out, boys. What is it? Hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge. How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge.